Let us start. First off, choose what kind of clothes you will wear. What colour do you want them to be? Great! Now choose the animal you want to be. Yay. Good choice. What colour do you want to be? Would you like to wear glasses? Do you want to wear a hat? Well done. Now, if you want to start playing, choose yes. If you want to make a change, Welcome to Peppa Pig's Town. You'll have a lot of fun here. We're going to meet Peppa in a moment, but first, let's try walking. Use the stick to move around. What a nice flower. Why don't you get close to it? Now, press a button to touch it. Remember to use this button when it appears on the screen. The butterfly is flying away. Let's follow it. What's that? There's a fence blocking the way. Not to worry, you can use the same button to open the gate. Sometimes you will need to move things out of the way to keep going. Remember to use this button when it appears on the screen. Hello! Welcome to the town! Where are you going, little one? To talk to Miss Rabbit, walk up to her and press the action button. Are you going to see Peppa? She's just up the hill. Keep walking and you'll be there in a minute. Bye now! Well done. You've learned how to... <laughs> My friend Pepper Pig A new friend has come to visit Pepper. How exciting! <laughs> oh, goody, you're here! Welcome! We're going to have a lovely time! You're here, you're here! We're going to have the best day ever! This is my room. Do you like it? I have lots of toys in the basket. still is boring. Let's go somewhere. <laughs> hmm. Hello, Peppa. I see you have a new friend. Oh, would you mind turning it back on so I can read? What's the matter, George? Why are you 
crying. Dinosaur. <laughs> Dinosaur. What's that, George? You've lost Mr. Dinosaur? Don't worry. I'm sure it hasn't gone far. Could you have left it outside? George and Pepper need your help to find Mr. Dinosaur. He must be somewhere nearby. We will find it! We're good at finding things! Follow me! Mr. Potato! Do you like Mr. Potato? Pepper does. Follow me! Dinosaur! <coughs> I can see it! It's stuck in that tree! Next to the muddy puddle. Let's see if we can get it down. It seems that Mr. Dinosaur is very high up in the tree. Perhaps they could use the help of someone taller. Shaking the tree will not help. <laughs> Back home. This is my daddy. Why don't we say hello to him? <clears throat> hello, Pepper. I see you have a new friend. Get it back! Stuck in the tree? <laughs> How did it ever get there? Let's take a look. Hmm. Perhaps instead of trying to reach it, it will be easier to make him come down to us. And how are we going to do that, Daddy? Dinosaur. Well, I'm a bit of an expert in these things. <laughs> as simple as that. It worked. Thank you, Daddy. I didn't know dinosaurs could climb trees. Dinosaur. <laughs> Good job. George got Mr. Dinosaur back and everyone is having a great time. <laughs> back home. Having lots of fun. That's great, Pepper. What are you doing, George? Dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Potato. Do you like Mr. Potato? Pepper does. Let's play with this. <laughs> Super Potato! Here's the power of vegetables! Have you been to Potato City? I really want to go. <laughs> Mummy Pig, 
Have you seen my glasses? I can't find them anywhere. I don't think I have, Daddy Pig. Peppa, why don't you and your new friend look for Daddy Pig's glasses? They have to be somewhere around the house. Yes, yes, Mummy! We will find the glasses! <laughs> Have you? That's great, Pepper. Thank you. And thank you. You are a great friend to Pepper. Don't we go visit my granny and grandpa? The house is just ahead. Let's keep walking this way. Playgroup! You have arrived at the Playgroup, a place to learn and play with Pepper and her friends. Granny and Grandpa's house. This is my Granny and Grandpa's house. Grandpa is always in his garden and Granny takes care of the chickens. This is Granny and Grandpa Pig's house. Pepper always has a great time here. Polly Parrot imitates everything you do. Why don't you try jumping or making a sound? <coughs> Hello, Mrs Chicken. What are you doing here? Good to see you, Peppa. Ah, I see you've brought a friend. Hello. Have you seen a chicken around here? Yes, Granny. She just left. Oh, my. That won't do at all. Peppa, can you and your friend help me find the missing chickens? I don't think they will have gone very far. Yes, yes, Granny. We will find them. It seems Granny's chickens have left their coop. Why don't you help her by bringing all of the chickens back? Excellent. Only two more chickens left. <laughs> Thank you. I think there's still one chicken missing.
That was the last one. All of the chickens are safe and sound now, thanks to you. We could go and help Grandpa Pig in the garden. Hello, Mr. Bull. What's going on here? Hello, family. Hello, children. We are in the middle of doing some repairs on this road. What happened to the old road? There were some bumps caused by the tree's roots nearby, which made it dangerous to drive through. Not to worry. Mr. Rhinoceros and I will take care of it. I'm sure you're very busy. We'd better be on our way. Hmm. Is there a way to go through? Oh, yes. You can drive right by the road. Be careful. Oh, I see. Thank you. Goodbye, Mr. Bull. Goodbye, Mr. Rhinoceros. Thank you for fixing the road. You have arrived at the playgroup, a place to learn and play with Pepper and her friends. Hello everyone, this is my new friend. Hello! Very good. Lovely. It will look great on Pepper's wall. Three, two, one. Splendid. Now we go from big to small. Two, one, three. Now it's all jumbled up. Why don't you try it again? One, two, three. This goes from small to big. Very good. What a lovely drawing! Why don't you take it and hang it in Pepper's house? Lovely! It will look great on Pepper's wall.
Let's go this way. Children, today is a very special day. Do you know what day it is? Is it your birthday? No, it's not my birthday, Danny. Anyone else want to guess? How about you? Good guess! Today is Sports Day. Whoa! What is Sports Day? Sports Day is a very important day. Everyone must do sports today so we can all stay healthy. Let's go to the running track. Ooh! All right, children, start running on my count. Three, two, one, go! Come on, children! Very good, Peppa. And your friend is very fast. One last effort, children. You're almost at the finish line. Finished. Oh, congratulations. You all did a very good job. You all deserve a trophy today, don't you think, Peppa? Susie? Pedro? And you too, of course. Splendid! I hope we all learned about the importance of sports today. But can we still run if it's not sports day? Oh, of course! You can always run! Running is fun! <laughs> 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 Peppa's house. Back home. Ah, there you are. Peppa, we're taking you and your friends to Windy Castle. Windy Castle has a very tall tower. We'll get a view of the whole town. You'll see. Hooray! Dinosaur! No, George, I'm afraid there are no dinosaurs up there. Dinosaur! But you can take Mr. Dinosaur with you. Dinosaur! All right, then. Why don't you two go and wait for us in the car while we finish getting ready? Yes, Daddy. We'll go there right away. Let's go to the car. Daddy will drive us to Windy Castle. Castle. 
you have arrived with Pepper and her family at Windy Castle. Wow! I've never seen such a big castle. Come on, let's go inside. The view from the top is amazing. You'll see. <laughs> <laughs> Looking through the telescope makes everything seem closer. Why don't you take some time to look around? Do you recognize this? It's our house. Oh, yes, Daddy. I can see my bedroom window from here. That looks like Granny and Grandpa's house. And look, Granny and Grandpa are outside. Do you think they can see us? <laughs> I don't think so, Peppa. We're very far away from them. Looking through the telescope makes everything seem closer. Why don't you take some time to look around? Do you recognise this? It's our house. Oh, yes, Daddy. I can see my bedroom window from here. Of course. Not now, though. We're enjoying Windy Castle today. Looking through the telescope makes everything seem closer. Why don't you take some time to look around? Do you recognise this? It's our house. Oh, yes, Daddy. I can see my bedroom window from here. Potato City! Can we go, Mummy, please? Of course. Not now, though. We're enjoying Windy Castle today. The playgroup. No one's there, though, because it's not playgroup time. And there's Snowy Mountain. The view is fantastic. But it seems to be very cold up there. We found the museum! I love the museum. Dinosaur. <laughs> look, look. I can see Miss Rabbit in her hot air balloon. She must be waiting to take someone to Snowy Mountain. Oh, today would be a perfect day to go to the beach. Mummy! Daddy! Can we come back to Windy Castle soon? Of course, Pepper. I'm glad you had a good time looking through the telescope. I knew you would love it. Windy Castle is a lot of fun. Using the telescope from the top, you can spot many places, even some that are very far away. Pepper's house. Back home. Granny and Grandpa's house. This is my Granny and Grandpa's house. Grandpa is always in his garden and Granny takes care of the chickens. This is Granny and Grandpa Pig's house. 
Pepper always has a great time here. We have arrived. But, Grandpa, Granny, where is all the sand? Well, this is a rocky beach. So instead of sand, it's full of rocks. Oh, we wanted to build sand castles. What are we going to do? Don't worry. There are plenty of fun things to do on this rocky beach. If you look around... You will find pools of water between the rocks. It's fun to see what's in them. That's right. When the sea goes out, it always leaves behind something special in the rock pools. Billy, what kind of things are we going to find? Why don't you and your friend have a look in the rock pools and put what you find in the bucket? Take a look in the rock pools on the beach and show Granny and Grandpa Pig the things you find. Look, I have found something very shiny. It's a coin. Perhaps it once belonged to a pirate. Whoa, I love pirates. found a crab in the rock pool. Crabs love to hide in rock pools. Be careful not to get your finger pinched. Oh no, don't be a naughty crab. <gasps> a seashell, and it's a really big one. Did you know that if you put a shell to your ear, you can hear the sea? Really? Whoa. Congratulations. You have found all the things in the rock pools and have learned a lot about rocky beaches. Let's see what's in the rock pools. Let's see what's in the rock pools. Let's go this way. Mummy, Daddy, you're here! Are you enjoying your time with Granny and Grandpa Pig? <laughs> That's great. Now how about we find a spot on the sand to sit down? This place seems like a nice spot. What's in the rock pools? Let's see what's in the rock pools.
we keep going... Hello, Mr. Bull. What is going on here? Hello, family. Hello, children. We are in the middle of doing some repairs on this road. What happened to the old road? There were some bumps caused by the tree's roots nearby, which made it dangerous to drive through. Not to worry. Let's go inside and see our friends. The museum! It's a wonderful day to get some good views from up in the hot air balloon. Yes, please! Snowy Mountain! The ski lift looks fun. Oh, we could ice skate. That's fun too. Go down the mountain. Ooh, a snowman! I love snowmen. We should build one ourselves. Peppa wants to build a snowman. You will find all the parts you need in the snow. Over there, look! We can use that bit for a face! This is the best snowman ever! We did it! Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Let's go this way.
let's go this way. I think these will be good for you. Be careful. Don't go down the hill too fast. Have fun. I'm right behind you. <laughs> If you get too cold, Miss Rabbit will take us back in the balloon. It's a wonderful day to get some good views from up in the hot air balloon. Yes, please. little bird. What are you doing here? Has it come to sing a song to us? I don't know. Have you, little bird? Chirp, chirp. Goodbye, little bird. Come visit us soon. The forest! It's so pretty! Let's follow it! Oh my, there's rubbish everywhere! Perhaps you should help Pepper clean the forest. Rubbish on the ground. We should put it in the rubbish bin. Got one. Well done. If we all do our part, it's easy to keep the forest clean. Whose tracks are these? If we follow them, we'll find out. Maybe it's insects. It is. Could it be a bird? Wow! Ants! <laughs> Did you guess the animal? What a lovely spot for camping! Ah, Peppa, I see you and your friend are already here. Hello, Peppa. Hello, Hello Peppa. Hello, Peppa's Hello, Peppa. friend. friend. 
Hello, everybody. Children, children, now that we're here, you need to pitch your tents. And we need someone to collect sticks for the campfire. We'll do it, Madame Gazelle. We'll collect the sticks. Madame Gazelle has asked you to collect sticks so she can build a campfire. Follow Pepper and help her get enough sticks for the campfire. Sticks, sticks, sticks. We need to collect lots of sticks. Got one. I need a few more sticks. Would you get them for me? Should be enough. Let's get back to Madame Gazelle. Ah, oh, excellent job. Now, why don't you pitch your tent while I prepare the campfire? Get around, children. Who wants to hear a song? Me! 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 me. me. Okay, then. Ooh. We're playing a tune and we're singing a song with a ping and a bong. A bing. Bada bing boo. Bing bong bing. Bing bong bingly bongly boo. Bada bing boo. Bing bong bing. Bing bong bingly bongly boo. Bada bing boo. Bing bong bing. Bing bong bingly bongly boo. Bada bing boo. Bing bong bing. Bing bong bingly bongly boo. Mummy and Daddy Pig and George have come to have a lovely picnic in the forest. <laughs> what a wonderful day to have a picnic in the forest. Come on, let's find a nice spot to sit down and have lunch. How about we go that way? This place seems about right, doesn't it? Can I have the basket, Daddy Pig? Oh, um, yes, of course. What's Rig? Your face has gone very red. I, um, I think I have left the picnic basket in the car. Oh, no. We will have to go and get it then. Perhaps you and Peppa could head back to the car and bring the basket. Of course, Mummy. We'll be back in no time. Daddy Pig has left the picnic basket in the car. They need you to go back and get it for them. Let's go back to the car and get the picnic basket. Basket. It smells delicious. Thank you, you two. Let's all take a seat now. Oops, I guess I'm a bit hungry. <laughs> Good job. You brought the picnic basket back. And now Pepper's family can enjoy a delicious lunch in the forest. This goes here, this goes there, and... Voila! <laughs> These sandwiches are delicious, Daddy Pig. Yes, Daddy. Why, thank you. How about you? Do you like them? 
But it seems there's only Daddy's sandwich left. Oh. Daddy, Daddy, we have to give them some food. Oh, <laughs> all right. There you go, ducks. I'm full. Well, at least someone is. <laughs> oh, Daddy, you're always a bit full. <laughs> <laughs> Peppa's house. Back home. Standing still is boring. Pepper, you and your friend have been very busy, haven't you? We've heard you've been helping people around the town. Yes! My friend is very helpful! I see. Well, so are you, Pepper. And because you've been so good, we've decided to take you both to Potato City. I love Potato City! Oh, Potato City, here we come! Daddy Pig? Didn't you get a bit dizzy last time you got on the potato rocket? Yes. Well, I'm sure it won't happen this time. <laughs> Daddy Pig, you never learn. Potato City is a magical place full of exciting things where Mr Potato himself will teach you the importance of vegetables. Go to the car when you're ready and we'll be on our way. Potato City! Potato City, the place to explore and have fun and learn about the importance of vegetables. Hooray! Ah, we're finally here. It's bigger than I remembered. Hello and welcome to Potato City! Have you come to have fun? Yes, yes! Have you come to explore? Yes, yes! Have you come to learn about the importance of eating fruit and vegetables at least five times a day? Um, yes. Fantastic! Then you are going to have a lot of fun. Remember to visit the whole park. There are plenty of things to do and plenty of things to see. All right then, run along children, have fun. I think I'll skip this one. Oh. Okay. Ready? Here we go! Again! 
I'll definitely skip the second round. <laughs> <laughs>